me welcome our friends and colleagues from Morocco uh, for this very important uh, first session of the uh, U.S.-Morocco Strategic Dialogue. Stay up, never sleep, cause we gotta go. That way, that way, that way. Nation deep, move these on the road. Road, 70. I stay up, sleeping in my bed. Why, cause there they go, trying to stand the process in my bed. My land, my land. We get all the problems in my land. My land. God bless all the problems in my land. Shout with the love. I am a god. Yeah. I know my fam long of my days. Yes. Guy in a shot. Hey. I throw to him Mary, get bloody like Harry. Die in my prom. Like busting the grapes and pressing her bond. Get better with time. I'm going home to the fortress. Memorize all the records of the most library in my conscience. Library of the Congress. Library by the context. 1492. Talk about the Spanish when it came to conquest. In real life, playing contra man. Trying to feel with the contraband. And all life for an honest man, all night for my daughter On a hot block with no mind up in my land That's express trust in the plan Do I leave profit the man? Who I be? Count with Steve Vance Yes indeed, this be my land I stay up, never sleep Cause we gotta go That way, that way yeah. Nation D, move these on the road Road, 70 I stay up, sleeping in my plan Why cause there they go Trying to snatch the process in my land City corpse. Ten thousand years haven't been a corpse. Never. Foreigners came to my land, pointing guns and swinging Jesus cross. Empire, not a cityscape. Five atomic, not shitty lakes. Continent, not turtle island. Noblemen, not a wild man. Home is North America, not a stranger, but the landlord. Free white people, not Negro, black, Ethiopian, colored. Navigating with my water. Blacks are still getting slaughtered. Nationality, the order. Foreigners create world borders. Calling themselves governors since they can't call themselves bait. To keep you in ignorance, they replace the E with the A. Keep you defended, always a defendant. Kill your brother over sneakers, but when the highway men kill you, you won't defend it. I stay up, never sleep, cause we gotta go. Genesis, astral plane interests, invoke the nemesis, abstract 
Fake images of past life kicking in danger. Running for your life, you're finishing. Morris or more. Key man or oracle. Using trinity powers to cipher allegorical. Lost in metaphorical. Holy books are metaphysic. Facts like a dirty moon or a Drew Ali critic. Calling them Thomas or Walter and get your face caved. Or cut like a close shave. Drowned in my brain waves. Squash my heat waves. Activating Kundalini. Abyssinia invaded by Mussolini. Selassie I am exiled. Reptile in Genesis. Negro superior in real. All I see is false evidence. VAR yeah, feminists. Talk torn by elephants. More like the prejudice but want Moorish benefits. When you feel the cold magnetic resonance. Apis horns of the sacred book called Maleficent. Great cosmic mothers. Return to blessedness. No pestilence. Ace all the testaments. Tap into remembrance. Never to forget again. Use energy right. Not put spell effects on men. Wander under earth plane with no they live shades. Keeps you a mental slave as the horizon fades. It's been decades since Christian crusades. Not enough rebellions. Too many vigil bouquets. Holding on to the fence. Burning on doomsday. War ruled by Mars. It might be on a Tuesday. Canaan Land Moors presents Comment on Sense and Quick Quick. What we do here is we add some common sense thinking to everyday situations or comments that may arise. Want to give it a try? Islam Moors. Peace and love to all the Moors worldwide. Peace and love to all the Moors. Definitely do some cleaning up people's perspectives so they know exactly what's going on. Islam. Islam, Islam. Peace and love, peace and love. Hope all is well with you, brother, man. All is well, man. Islam. So, as Canaan land Moors, we are representatives of Noble Juali 100. Because ever since 2010, whether it's whether January 8th falls on a weekend or the weekend before January 8th or the weekend after January 8th, we've been having Noble Juali celebration mm. to honor the prophet. Mm -hmm. Not to honor Supreme Grand Sheikhs. Mm -hmm. Not to honor grand sheiks and not to honor mm -hmm. any, none of them people. None mm -hmm. of those people matter. Mm -hmm. I don't matter. I'm a grand sheik and I don't matter. Mm -hmm. Because when I check the record, I don't see it happening like that by Mars. When I look, when I look at the landscape of activity of Mars. The people who are in the temple that stand at their noble Juali and they've been repping that forever, they don't rep noble Juali like Moors who are out the temple rep noble Juali. I know that because I'm one of those Moors, but I'm also a grand sheep. I also know that Grand Major Temple knows who we are. I know that Bratton Bay and all those Temple 13 Moors, all those Moors know who I am. If you talk to any Moors, anybody who says that they're Grand Sheik, if they've been Grand Sheik mm -hmm. since 2008 to now, they know who I am. Mm. Mm. Not because of some, some, you know what I mean, um, look at me or whatever like that, but, but we're active Moors. And we only ride with other active moors. Now, every Sunday, we have meetings at our temple. Right? Every Sunday, we have meetings at our temple. And the people who come to those meetings, they're, they're the grand body. as far as where we're at, because there's mm -hmm. nothing here called Moors, Moors Science Temple, Moors anything before us. And there was no there was no representation of anything called Moorish here before we started working this. Mm. Mm. Right? Mm. 
Now they're not gonna they're gonna tell you don't go to RV Day publications and all this because th those are the sovereign mores or whatever. But we have the article on RV Day publications that Nobu Juali came to Toronto and wanted to start stuff here. Mm, you said he came to Toronto? He, the plan was mm -hmm. Nobu Juali is supposed to have his his base here. He's supposed to have something here. Just mm. like it's supposed to be everywhere else. Like Why? It's supposed because to be everywhere he, else. Because mm -hmm. he's a universal prophet. As well. All right. So if he's a universal, and then we're in Canaan land that people mm -hmm. call Canada, Canaan. and we're saying we rep for Noble Juali, and we have Noble Juali Day every year for the past 10 years. Mm -hmm. We have a community barbecue every year where we bring, we provide the finance. So people can come eat for free. That's what our temple does out here. I'm not seeing that being, being done by other moon science temples, but they're supposed to be for our people and, and trying to bring us together and all that. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. So, so automatically I'm looking at people funny. And on mm -hmm. top of that, I read the FBI papers, all 3,000 pages of the FBI papers of the Moon Science Temple of America. Mm -hmm. And I don't need some scratched out name to try to think or assume who sold out. We already know who sold out. Mm -hmm. You don't need to names. Activity lets us know who sold out. Because the activity of this is get this to our people at all costs. Mm -hmm. They don't have a choice to listen to anything else other than this. Because this is the only thing that's going to save them. Ain't nothing else going to save our people. They're Zero. Wrong. There's nothing else that's going to save our people. Nothing that they could try is going to save them if it doesn't have nationality attached to it. Indeed, man. Indeed. Every single Moorish American who says they're a grand sheik should be talking how I talk. Every, every grand governor of every single Moorish Science Temple of America should at least have a book out talking about this information. I have six. And everything that I make goes back to the temple. I go, I go on a slave, the plantation with some Europeans to make my finance, because I already know that our people aren't going to fund their own salvation. I already know that. I'm not playing any of these games with people. I'm going to struggle in my life because I want to prove some BS about I'm a more. This is this is survival first, self-preservation. So I, I'm going to preserve myself, how I see fit. And once I do that according to love, truth, peace, freedom, and justice, nobody can tell me that I can't do whatever. What do you mean? I can go down the phone, thousands of mores in my phone, that I could call every single more in my phone. And probably five of those mores that talk some BS about who Joe did something or he did some BS or whatever. Everybody else is going to be riding with Canaan land mores. Like, yeah, those are some mores to... You want classes? Go, go. You want? You have a situation? You want to know where to whatever? Talk to that brother Kujo. He knows Moors all over. He'll definitely connect you with a Moor who could put you on to where this is supposed to be at. You know what I mean? Yeah. So yeah. I want you. I just, just just putting that out so you know I'm not some came yesterday Moor. Mm -hmm. mm -hmm. I'm not some social media Moor. Mm -hmm. I'm not exactly. Facebook more and, and mm -hmm. whatever. We are more who are with the people. I can call mm -hmm. the people on my phone. Let's line up all the grand sheets and tell them, go through your phone. Call, call for me right now 20 more that you saved their life. If you're a grand chief, if you're a grand governor, if you're a grand whatever, I don't care what you are. If you have grand in front of your stuff, mm -hmm. then pull out your phone and show me 20 people in your phone that you could say, as a grand sheep, I saved these people's life. Mm. Mm. I saved their life. They were going into their lower self, and here's the number you could talk to them yourself. Let them tell you what Pujo did for them. Let them mm. tell you what you know, Brother Yusuf did for them. Let them tell you what Brother Mario did for them. Let them tell you whatever. Let them tell you what Brother Jamal did for them. That, that, that when they went to more science temple to get the help, more science temple telling them, we don't give a that, that's sovereignty and all that stuff. Mm -hmm. 
-hmm. Why are we going to help you try to get your children back from, you know, the corporate state or whatever, when mm -hmm. that's their job? What do you mean? Why? And then when we talk to certain Moors, we're seeing them going to the mayor's stuff and getting proclamations and they're doing flag raisings with the mayor and all this stuff as if the corporations are legitimate forms of government or something. That's democracy. Mm -hmm. You know, would you say something about republic and stuff like that? Oh yeah, free national okay, government. So, okay, so if nobody Jolly said republic, but then more Science Temple of America grand sheets in 2020 are going to tell you, let's go down to the mayor's office for this proclamation so they could raise our flag <laughs> and they could stand at our podium <laughs> with us and act as if that's government. That's McDonald's. What do you mean you, you stand up with Burger King and you tell me I'm taking you serious? I see, I see, I see what you're saying. I see what you're saying, Mo. I you know what I'm saying? saying? Yeah. Right? Yeah. You know, yeah. we're not yeah. some just yesterday Moors. Moors know who we are. But we know that there's active Moors and there's passive Moors. Mm -hmm. And not all the passive Moors are sellouts. But, you know, if you're on that side, you're guilty by association. Mm -hmm. where, this is where we come from, based on the background that we have of this. Not hearsay, but we went and studied. We sat at different feet of different elders in the Moorish movement. Who, they straight told us that our own sold us out. They mm -hmm. know Europeans. Mm -hmm. They know Europeans selling this out like that. It's our own that's selling it out. And our own is selling it out because they're on the passive side. They're not about taking this to the hedges and the highways. They're about to keep this in the building called Morris Science Temple of America. And if you want this, you have to go there to get it. But it doesn't really go like that in reality. Out here on the streets where we are, it doesn't go like that. No mm -hmm. paper is going to save you. No card is going to save you. You knowing your nationality is what's going to save you. Mm -hmm. Knowledge mm -hmm. is what's going to save you. Not mm -hmm. grand sheets sign my paper. Or I have a seal of whatever my seal is, the seal of the whatever, so these Europeans can recognize it. You know what this is about. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. But I just want to open up if you have any questions or Indeed. comments. Indeed. You know, first I would like to say, you know, you know, honors to you for your work in the Moorish paradigm. You're in Canada, right? And it's honors for you to, to establish a Moorish community or association or a temple, however you want to call it. Common but sense, right? Right. However you want to it's call common it. Common sense. You see what I'm saying? Right. But at the same time, as, as a member of the Morris Science Temple of America, my temple does the same thing your, your temple does. My sheiks have, have books out. We are active. But one thing I can say as a critique is we do need to spread it more. I seem that it seems that we're content with our membership. And that, yeah, if, we, if you come to the Sunday school, you come to the Holy Day meeting, you're going to get the demonstration. But I, I do agree with you that members of the Morris Science Temple need to get out in the community around and, and, and actually sp spread the gospel. You know, Noble Jolly stood on the, he stood outside saying, come on, Asiatics, and learn about your nationality and birthright. And a lot of Moors are in the temple. That's where they stay at. And it's valid. But at the same time, we have to come together as a nation, an Asiatic nation, under the bond of affection of with our holy quran our 101s our oral statements that we have because there's oral statements that aren't even released it's oral statements that are in the private chambers of the more science temple of america at this point personally i think that should be released because it, should, it shouldn't are you familiar with those with those so, so, so let me ask you this then yeah so, so. So what does it say to the people who have this information right mm -hmm. now, mm -hmm. right? And they're not giving it to people. They're sitting on it. What does that tell you? That says something right there. That doesn't sit no, well. well what does it say, though? Not that it says something, but what does it say? It says that certain grand sheets, they only keep information for their membership to see. And you have to become a part of their membership and basically sit there and excuse my language matter of fact i'm not even going to say it okay but, right so, so it, now now isn't that wouldn't wouldn't that be considered dereliction of duty 
Can you say that again? W wouldn't that be considered the election of duty? What What do you mean would, by the would, election of duty? Would, would, wouldn't that be considered treason? Ultim ultimately, that's where it comes down to we need to unify and have a council to where we can actually pinpoint these and identify these situations and bring them out to the forefront. No, no, that, that, that's, that's, the thing, that's the thing that you're, you're not recognizing. Mm -hmm. They're not bringing it out to the forefront They're of anything. They're not bringing it out. Because Moors have already done that. Mm. We, mm. We, we have already went to all the different conscious whoever, right? Mm. For example, we call the Unity Summit. This, mm -hmm. is what, this is what we did in our, in our territory. Yeah. We're the Moors, right? Right. So we're going to have a Unity Summit to bring everybody together under that we're Moors. Mm-hmm. Right, sent stuff to the Nation of Islam, personal stuff. Grand Sheik sent them personal invite. Sent stuff to any black whatever. Sent stuff to you name them, anybody conscious. Mm -hmm. Few people showed up to this thing. Mm. Few people showed up to this. People who I know who are heads of certain associations or whatever. Because I've been out here doing conscious whatever. I'm not just came yesterday. Like I said, even when I was black, I was doing community centers and all that. Mm -hmm. Right? Even as Negro black colored, I wasn't just, you know what I mean? Negro black colored. I was conscious Negro black colored. Mm -hmm. So we were doing community things even then. Indeed. So, so, so the so, unity, is, the unity, okay. the unity is this right here. Mm -hmm. This is the unity. Mm -hmm. The unity is this. It doesn't matter who Grand Sheik is, who Grand whatever it is, who right. whatever was the what is it? If I tell you Islam more, what are you gonna say? Islam more. Uh, all right, that's that's not unity. So nothing matters now. We mm -hmm. should be all on the same. We should on be the on same, the same. Going to sit, yep. right? Hey, yep. you got yep. red fez on, whatever like that. You, are you a more? What are you going to say? No, I'm not that or whatever. No. You're going you're, you're gonna to go with it because you know what it is. All right? That's the unity. The unity that they're talking about with all the temples coming together. and then the, That ain't happening with these people. Those, those people are traitors. That's why they're not telling you about the real info. Why are they hiding oral statements? Right? Right. This is Nobu Juali, who's the prophet, who by now, all his stuff's supposed to be out by now. 100 years? We still talking about... He said, uh, take away all the secrets and all that stuff. And then people are talking about they got some added chamber and people can't join and all this. What mm -hmm. do you mean? How? Mm -hmm. That doesn't even make sense. Right. Even though we understand that, you know, you would have some people who have a higher degree of knowledge. So they might be on a different plane. And you would set up, like you're saying, some type of council that these heads or whatever are going to sit in a particular seat and administer for the people. Mm -hmm. Because their real job is, it's the people's sovereignty that they have as Grand Sheep or whatever. It's not theirs or Nobu Juali gave it to them. Mm -hmm. It's the people who play in their membership every month or whatever, who the Grand Sheiks and whatever are obligated to. Indeed, indeed. But that's not limited to more Science Temple members or whatever. There's a broader jurisdiction because when you look on the wall of every Moorish Science Temple of America, they have a Moorish flag there, which has nothing to do with religion. Absolutely nothing to do with religion. Mm -hmm. So for this quote unquote religious building organization, corporation to have a national flag in its building mm -hmm. would mean that that's not doing religious stuff then. Because why would they have a national flag in there? Unless mm -hmm. it's unless it's a regency or an embassy or a, a consulate or something like that. Nothing well, else is going to have a, a, a national flag inside the place. Well, let's 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 see. Let's let's think about what Noble Ali said. Noble Ali said this is a more this is a more is divine and national movement. He did say it was a national movement. Mm -hmm. So there is room for the flag. In a national movement, the, because nationality is your quality of character, and every nation has their own religion. Every nation does. Yeah. Their predominant. But remember, but remember, 
remember that, yes, the flag is national, but the star is Venus, which is divine. Mm. But that has nothing to do with religion. That has to do with astrology and cosmogony. That the same grand sheik and whoever like that are going to tell you, you shouldn't study astrology and all that because that's devil worship or whatever. When that's our sciences. Like my experience, my experience with grand sheiks is different than the majority of people's experience because they never, I, I, I never had grand sheiks tell me not to study this information or anything like that. If anything, it's, it's a proper place and use in the temple. In the temple, we it's certain things that is addressed, right? Outside of the temple, it's essentially whatever you want to study is go for it, right? But you know, and not, and that's what I had to learn in the temple. You can't come in there with all your ideas. You have to be able to just sit there, right? Take in what the what your grand sheik is saying, especially if you're all on the same page, your membership, right? It's like at your temple when you demonstrate on your Sunday meetings. Everyone's in there. They feeling that energy. They need that uplifted energy that you bring them through the love, through the sound of your voice, right? So the same thing at the temples, you know. Like yeah, there's more moors that's they dirty moors, right? But ultimately, love is the only savior. We gonna look in my in, in my temple. It's love there. But this is what this is what this yeah. is what I'm saying. Mm -hmm. That this is the unity. Mm -hmm. Has nothing to do with titles and who's the head of the whatever. I if agree. you know Islam I agree. and I know Islam, then there shouldn't be any issue. The issue is going to come in when we start getting together and we start bringing down, okay, well, you know what, all right, well, we're coming together. You know what I mean? What are we going to do now that we're coming together? We're not coming together to sit and pray and sing hymns to Noble Jawali or whatever. Right, right. Right. Like we're not coming in for, to do that. If we're going to unify, it's about us doing our self-determination and all that. It's, mm -hmm. it's not about anything else. Yeah, but indeed. Self, but but, but self-determination is in line with the national aspect that if, if your grand sheik is in the position where he's in, where he doesn't have somebody over him that's going to tell him he can't and he can't and whatever, mm -hmm. then it should be no, no deal for you as a member mm -hmm. that you built with a grand sheet who you know what this grand sheet might be solid let's you know what i mean unify with them you give mm -hmm. the number to your grand sheet your grand sheet calls the grand sheet that's how we're gonna go mm -hmm. and then yep. when the grand sheet calls then we build and we see where where it's at and but that but this is the unity that's this is what you are you're a foot soldier for them not only are you are you getting measures from your grand sheet, but you're getting measures from any grand sheet that you're supposed to connect with. Mm -hmm. As a as a representative of a temple that's in a different jurisdiction, that if you're a regency, and we're a regency, and we're both saying that we're Moors, then we should have something as far as a connection. Mm -hmm. Why wouldn't we? If we know that, that all this is Morocco, forget, you know, New York and Jersey and whatever mm -hmm. like that. If all this is Morocco, and we're all here. Then what, why isn't there why isn't there more of this? Because eventually you're going to get to the top people who are the traders, who tell people you could do this and you can't do that. As far as being a more science temple, you can talk to these people. You can't talk to those moors because those moors over there are the street moors, and the street moors those are the moors who are just you know they wear their fez outside the temple and you know what I mean. Mm -hmm. Talk all types of crazy stuff to have people think that being part of this is a club. Right. It's not a social. Mm -hmm. It's not a social. It's club. not a social organization. This mm -hmm. is about nationhood. Mm -hmm. So there should be unity across. Indeed. Indeed. Yeah. 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 Automatically. Indeed. I it agree. Should it should be enough. That should be enough to. That should be enough right there to show that this is my brother or sister. Not only in in Islam, but in in nationhood, we share the same. Hold blood. on, I'm not, my phone my phone rang and I'm not right. even hearing you right now. Indeed, so, well, I had a question I wanted to ask. Off. You. I'm gonna yeah. cut it off and then bring you back on. All right.
Yeah, just send the invite thing again. Peace, peace. Yeah. I had a question I wanted to ask you. Yeah, uh, I heard not Can't hear me? Go ahead. Can you hear me? Yeah, I can. I hear you. Yeah, I had a question I wanted to ask you. Um, I heard you talk about religion. In regards to religion, uh, what are your thoughts on that in regards to to Islam and the faith of Muhammad. Uh, what what are your thoughts on that? Do you make salat? Do you fast during Ramadan? Or are you more of the scientific to where you apply the science in a way where you're the living manifestation of it? I self law master. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. That's that's my religion. Mm -hmm. So I self law master is I don't have to sit down in the lotus to meditate. Mm -hmm. You know what I mean? Mm -hmm. Because this is this is being this is about being in tune or being in harmony. Mm -hmm. And then what are you in harmony with? Obviously, you know what I mean the, the astrological aspect of the being, right? And then that that's religion. Anything else is dogma. For me. Okay, okay, I, I understand the dogma and the propaganda that's instituted in religion. I understand such. Um, but at the same time, I look at each religion because the prophet Noble Drew Ali said we honor all true and divine prophets. Yeah, I, I took that as him saying that any school of knowledge, like Islam, a school of knowledge, Buddhism, a school of knowledge, Christianity, a school of knowledge. If you can, if you can take the science and find out where you are in it, in these books, in these religious texts, and you can apply it to your life. Uh, I feel like that's the beauty of religion. I don't think religion is the dogmatic religion is bad for your spirit and bad for your soul. It boxes you in. But being able to understand that your forefathers founded this religion of mm -hmm. Islam and they practiced it, it's safe to say that you can practice it yourself. It's not something right. that's going to go at you spiritually, unless. Which is of law and mass. Yeah. yeah. Be that's before what all that the sex, before all the sex, the Shia, before the Sunni, all yep. yeah. Before, before all that, right? So, so that means before salat and mm -hmm. before pray five times a day and all that too. Mm -hmm. Because <laughs> we're, yeah, saying, I, we're I, saying before that, right? Mm -hmm. Then because we could look at ancient Egyptian hieroglyphs and see people doing salat. Mm -hmm. They were Muslim. Our self law and master. Uh, you know, and and where they and and where the Moors get it from the ancient Kemetic because the Moors were My the high priests of Anu. Ma'at. The Moors, the Moors were the high priests of Anu. Mm. Mm. Okay. The Moors, the Moors were the high priests of Anu. Mm. If the Moors were high priests of Anu, then that's that science that they call religion today. Yeah, we know that it's all ours. Yes, yeah, all ours. The, the way that it's that it's presented, even in the Moor science temple. Is not Islam law master. It's presented as, you know, um, Holy Quran is a holy book, and mm -hmm. you know what I mean. From that mm -hmm. religious idea, when it's really broader than that, and if the people aren't told that it's broader than that, then whoever's telling them something is playing them. Yeah. Because if they're yeah. grand, whatever, they're supposed to be telling them straight that yo, Quran is knowledge, order, rhythm, astrology, like. It's not a book, and then you go through the book and, and whatever, mm -hmm. right? Noble Jewel is not you know, some prophet, and then we just oh praises due to Allah, just like praises due to Noble Jewel and Muhammad, and that that ain't what this is, right? Mm -hmm. This mm -hmm. is this is absolutely connecting us to something way beyond what majority of the people who say that they're the adepts or whatever aren't willing to go but Juali took away all the secrets so why are they keeping secrets yeah that's what doesn't sit right with me at this moment it's just like release you know, it it's a hundred years and, plus now at this point and like you're saying 
like you're saying, right? There's more Science Temple that we deal with that they're right and exact, and they call themselves more Science Temple, and they look at it just like how we look at it. Mm -hmm. They might look at certain things on a different perspective, whatever, but there's no we need to debate something or prove something or whatever like that mm -hmm. because we're on the high road. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. So because we're on the high road, we're looking at it only the way of truth. There's no other way to look at it. Yeah. Mm -hmm. And then if you're not looking yeah. at it from the perspective of truth, then mm -hmm. obviously you're a fraud or you're mm -hmm. lying or you're cheating or you're, you're something. Mm -hmm. It doesn't make sense to me that you're going to be a more, you're a Moorish American. But then you make t-shirts that are for Moors, but then you have your children wearing TikTok t-shirts. <laughs> <laughs> when TikTok is some pedophilia stuff. Right? <laughs> Because because I have nieces, mm -hmm. so this is not this is not some game thing. You know, what I mean, these people already have their thing in place where they have little girls twerking and stuff like that. Right now, it's already in this place, and you're still perpetuating the same stuff. When we could be, like we said, unifying, mm -hmm. right? Like we said with the brother, we put the sent them the message this is not something we're not trying we're trying to sell some t-shirts or something like that we have a morris school with children mm. we want to connect them to moorish culture send mm. us some shirts give us a deal on some shirts so we can have some shirts for the children it's not for us to sell or whatever this is my finance in my own pocket it's not no temple money or nothing like that mm. because i want to support a morris establishment because we have a school with children in it and we want them to wear more stuff. Right. We go to him and try to get the deal for the shirts. He's telling us a price that's higher than what we would get shirts for here. Wow. So I don't need to go to you for shirts. They're nothing personal. I just don't need to go to you. I get that you're a more and we're mores and all that stuff, but I don't need to go to you. Matter of fact, the more here who made t-shirts donated the 14 t-shirts that we needed. Mm. And the children are still happy with their t-shirt that says we are not a minority, which is sort of a Moorish theme. You know what I mean? And they're running with it and they're happy. But they got some free t-shirts. <laughs> and then this more, and then people are telling me about, well, well, we need unity amongst the Moors and all. What do you mean? I was, I was willing to put out some finance to get some t-shirts. And because of people's attitude, because they think that they're, you know what I mean? Like this more stuff is for some type of show or for some type of make you look like you're doing something more. So that means you're somebody. I mean, mm -hmm. what this is about. I saw Flan Master is what this is about. Mm. It's not about some, you know what I mean? Oh, yeah, we have a temple. And that's to say that we have a temple and all that. No, that's for us to have a school so that there could be children here learning about this. That's for mothers to be able to come here and be able to talk amongst each other or whatever like that comfortably because they have their mother's auxiliary or whatever like that that they can mm -hmm. go to. This is because, you know, people are looking for information. Matter of fact, just on Sunday, a sister just came to the door while we're closing up. Hey, um, this is more science temple. I need some information or whatever. I'm trying to find myself, whatever. Mm. Right? Brought her, gave her some literature. And, you know what I mean? That's what this is about. Like, we went to the temple that day just for that sister right there who didn't know about this that came in just seeing that it's open. That's like, what oh, I'm talking shit, about. It's open. That's what I'm talking about. That's exactly what I'm talking about. That needs to be the norm. We got to go the extra mile for each other. We have to go the extra mile for each other. It's the only way we're going to get it done, bro. We it's have not to. The, like, you know what I mean? But, but again... I'm only going the extra mile for you if you're dealing with love, truth, peace, freedom, and justice, if you honor noble Jew Ali, if you give honors to the Moorish, everything, if, mm -hmm. if you're on the frequency of where we're supposed to be and where we're going, yo, mm -hmm. we're riding. Moors know that. Moors know that's how we do. Mm -hmm. The only reason that certain people aren't unifying with us because they're on the mm -hmm. traitor side, and they just don't want to say I'm on the traitor side. <laughs> because it doesn't make sense that you wouldn't unify with Moors who are active. Mm -hmm. Like we tell more, go to rvbaypublications.com, go study. And then everybody who has something to say about rvbaypublications.com is saying that they're giving paperwork and selling cards and all this. Like, what are you talking about? RVB is a publications company. That has nothing to do with 
Moorish administration of governmental affairs. Nothing. Harvey Bay Publications is a publication expression. It has nothing to do with doing some Moorish things with seals and, and all that. <laughs> indeed, indeed, indeed. My whole thoughts on RV Bay publications is their judicial notice and proclamation. Uh, essentially, through the Moors, through the Moors community, the word on the the Moors street was that this judicial proclamation will lead will lead to you being considered as a paper terrorist. How true that is, it's up for debate. Oh, that's not for you debate. Know uh, you know, I'm not, I'm not, I'm not, I'm not against RV Bay because that's where I started. I started my studying on RV Bay, just as plenty of Moors. But I think a lot of Moors can read that information and kind of get a little ahead of themselves in regards to law. And then they thinking they can just go foul a lien on somebody. And that, yeah, but, and that but, but, but check this though. And that's not RV Bay's no... fault. That's not RV Bay's fault. But check this not every base fault though, yeah. How, how about how about this perspective? How about the people who have been playing religions with the Morris Science Temple of America, instead of exercising that this is a civic organization, which is law, then the people shouldn't have any issue with RV Bay publications and them teaching law. Mm -hmm. Because mm -hmm. the Morris Science Temple is supposed to supposed to teach law. I self mm -hmm. law and master. Law in the what, what do you think law is? What's that? What do you think we have a constitution for? Isn't that law? Yeah. Isn't isn't Noble Jewel is general laws and all this? <laughs> mm -hmm. So how is he talking about laws and then we're talking about religion and we're not looking at the people talking about religion as they're tripping? On the affidavit, it says the more science temple of America is found as a religious corporation, as well as the meaning of the more science the point of the more science temple of America is to basically spread the faith of Muhammad in America. And mm -hmm. the faith of Ali in America. Yeah. So it's a, the religion. The religious part is there, for in my opinion, in my belief, is there for political protection because oh, okay, the oh, first, no, okay, the first, right, hold, you know hold on, hold mm -hmm. on. So, so okay. So if the religion is there for political protection, right? Mm -hmm. What, what is the document used to protect religion? The, the United States Constitution. Oh, okay. So that means that it's about law, not religion. It is about law. The prophet All said. Right. The prophet said so it was a civic organization before they oh. reorganized. No, no, no. He said he said name change. He didn't say reorganize. Name change. Name change. You're right. Name right? change. Okay. So yeah. so so because so because something changes its name to something, there should be also a dissolution of the old thing, right? Yeah. If they're moving forward with this new name. There's supposed to be a dissolution of the whole thing. Mm -hmm. All right. No Moorish anybody has ever presented a dissolution of Moorish Holy Temple of Science, which mm -hmm. is the civic organization of the Moorish Science movement, which means that civics wasn't dead in the Moorish Science Temple. They were supposed to continue it because religion is because of constitution, exactly. not because of Allah or whatever. Mm -hmm. Religion is because of constitution, which is law. Mm -hmm. So they should be dealing with the Holy the Quran as a law book. The Holy Quran is supposed to be a law book, not just a religious book. Mm -hmm. Because it makes reference to law in there. If it's talking about magistrate and subject, that's law. Nobody can't tell me that's not law. Mm -hmm. It's a to your knowledge. Insufficient of knowledge is a good chapter two on law. It says if you have insufficient of knowledge, this is how you get abused by the by the rulers of the state. Which is the point mm -hmm. why you need to go to rvbaypublications.com, stay there so you can learn the law so you're not abused by the state. Mm -hmm. who, who, is in, who is in the practice of abusing people? Because of insufficiency right. of knowledge. Because right. of insufficiency of knowledge. Mm-hmm. Mm -hmm. Right? It's not. You know, so we're not some, you know, this is why this is why Moore's always say, 
anybody talking online crazy, they don't, they don't know who Kudro is because anybody could build with Kudro. Mm -hmm. Anybody could build with Kudro. Because it ain't, it ain't like that. I'm not a social media more. Mm -hmm. This is not me and you live on the Instagram. This is me building with a more. Mm -hmm. that, that's what this is. Unless I say, oh yeah, questions in the chat, chat doesn't matter like that. Because mm -hmm. everybody on there, they're either here for some info or they're more who I already know I can call them on the phone. Anybody on here. Mm -hmm. It's not just some, you know what I mean, people in the chat thing because they saw the live thing and they jumped on the thing. No, I call these people on the phone. Mm -hmm. This is actual real. This is not fiction. You know what I mean? And, and, and there's no debate. Nobu Juali is the man. The Morris Science Temple of America is the most needed institution amongst our people right now. It's needed, but it has to be from the right perspective. But it's from the, if it's from the wrong perspective, it might as well be some Negro, black, colored, whatever. Mm -hmm. Because yeah. the only direction we could go in is Put, giving this information out to the people, presenting this information to them, right? We, right. we already know the religious stuff. We already know the history stuff. We already know the metaphysics and we already know the whatever. But let's get with some law now. Mm -hmm. Let's start dealing with, with national affairs as mm -hmm. more. Let, let's, let all the grand sheep who are claiming that they're, you know what I mean, whatever, come together to write a letter to, to one of these heads of whoever somewhere else. Let them know that the Moors, the Moors have returned. Mm. How about we do that? They don't want to do that. They just want to meet up, pick their feet up, talk about how good stuff is going at their temple and all this, and then, and then go back to just sitting there, not doing anything. When there's mad work for us to do as Moors. Especially the people who claim that they got some knowledge, they got some title, that whatever. No, don't, don't don't tell me about about you know what I mean. I'm I'm I have I have my books on a Moorish publisher's website. A Moorish publisher published my books. And they go to some European or whatever. Moorish publisher put my books up. Everything that we sell goes back to the temple to, to, to pay for whatever the temple needs to pay for stuff because dues alone aren't going to cut it. Right? I don't get none of that. All the CDs or whatever that, that we do and all this. I ain't getting none of that. I'm not going platinum or nothing like that off of some, <laughs> some, some, some music. Hey, you know I mean? y'all snapping more. on it. Y'all snapping on the intro just to put that in but here. Give thanks, yo. Give thanks. Um, but the, the, the Moors who, who are where they're at in their frame of mind are the ones that are going to do something with this. Mm. The ones who we're waiting on to see, well, let's wait and see. We'll be waiting forever yeah. for these people to get down on some whatever because it ain't happening. Is Islam, Kujo, and, and my perspective on it is this, you know, me going into the temple... I want to get my sheikh appointment, and I want to I want to start my own temple, essentially, just like what you're doing. I want to have my own Moorish village, not my own, but all of ours. And I'm willing to build it brick by brick, fundraise it dollar by dollar. And I That's put my life on this. I put my life. I'm never turning back on this. Yeah. I put my life on this. I'm young. I'm two years. I proclaimed my nationality in 2018. Yeah. But I've been seeking more truth in it ever since. I'm passionate yeah. about this. And keep and keep seeking, but yeah. know that there's snakes in the grass while you're looking through the grass. Mm -hmm. It's mm -hmm. not just some grass; you're just going through the, the you know, what I mean, dancing mm -hmm. through the tulips because you know that you're a more. Mm -hmm. you there's right, snakes you in right. the grass. You right. You right. Right. You right. And and they might not even eat you. They might just hold you. They might just coil around you and just hold you. Mm. And keep you passive. Mm. Because you have the energy of, you know what I mean? 
the same words Juali talk about, new words, eyes wide open and all that stuff, seeing and knowing, and they're going to carry out the stuff that, that you know, people are playing around with. Mm. That's why they're mad with us, because we're those words. Mm. And then so we, only gravitate, we only gravitate with those morals. We only gravitate with morals who are looking at this from the right perspective. And the majority of the morals that we ride with, 80, 90% of the morals that we ride with, their perspective is RV Bay Publications as a foundation. Because we look at that as the online university for morals. I don't mm. care what anybody else thinks, but I'm a grand sheik and I go on that website regular. So why wouldn't I tell my members go there? If as a qualified adept or whatever like that, I went there. Indy, it's, it's great it's information it's on RV Bay's publication. I'm not taking nothing away from the information that's presented. I'm not taking nothing away from it. No, no, I know, I know. Just, just that, that's just to stress the point that they're about information. Because as soon as you start talking about judicial proclamation and then tying that to RV Bay publications, we know that traders told you that. That's not something you went out and found out. Somebody put that in your ear like that. And we know that there's people out there that are going to present it like that as if that's what it is when that's not what it is. Because we're, we're that and we're letting you know that's not what it is. People are playing games. Mm. Right? Because right. the Moral Science Temple of America it was, is the one who's supposed to be doing that. What, what the Great Seal National Association of Moorish Affairs is doing mm -hmm. with, the, with the judicial proclamation and name correction, mm -hmm. that, is, those are, that is activity that the Moorish Science Temple of America was supposed to be doing. But they weren't, which is why Great Seal National Association of Moorish Affairs started doing that type of work, because the work wasn't being done by the people calling themselves Moorish Science Temple of America, because majority of those people sold out. So where is the Great Seal now? Is that RV Bay? Is that the the remnants of the Great Seal Association? Is that who's running RV Bay now? When you when you when you look at the same way that that you, you made reference of the back of the 101 questionnaire, mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. right? And then certain things being set up, and then. Um, all those people whose names were mentioned ended up selling out and all you have left is the profit right all you had left were individuals who were active and activated certain things so that the moors were able to have something because if we waited on or relied on the moor science temple to do it it was not and will not be done in the capacity that it's supposed to be done for more. It's going to right. be done for the, for, from the perspective of this is just some religious thing and we're just going to go get some proclamations and do our Islams and then that's all this <laughs> is about. Right? They were supposed to be administering as a regency for Moorish Americans. People who are Negro black colored mm -hmm. were supposed to be coming off the street coming to the Morris Science Temple of America, not be given their nationality because you're proclaiming it. So ain't Morris Science Temple given anything to them? Hmm. Indeed. I Morris mean, I look, I look at the Morris Science Temple of America as when you're proclaiming your nationality, you're, the members are witnessing, are the witnesses. To, so that... Right. And, all right. right. Okay, right, right. So, so, so what, what's supposed to happen is... The Grand Sheik is not supposed to just take some picture in front of some flags. You're supposed to get your paperwork, your judicial proclamation, and whatever else. Mm -hmm. Right? And once you, get your, once you get your stuff, those are the witnesses for your documentation. They seal it, and then you go handle your affairs. Mm -hmm. and yeah, you go handle your affairs. You, you, you start putting in work. You just, it's not about sitting in the temple. You gotta exactly. go out and put in work. You have to exactly. We, it's no reason for us to, to not. Okay, the Moors are just hoarding information from the adept chamber, and that gives them some type of pride. But ultimately, that has, that does nothing for the nation. 
And again, that's and then again, that's why they would tell you don't go to RV Bay Publications because RV Bay Publications is going to give you that information from the attic chamber that these people are playing with people about. Mm. Because once you have the info from the attic chamber, then you know what I mean, like like the exactly. mysteries of the silent mysteries yeah. of the silent brotherhood. Mm -hmm. That's not attic chamber book. That's from the Korean Gospel. That's that's not that's not an attic chamber book though. Mm. That's not something limited to the Arab chamber. That's supposed to be the second, the second side of your Quran. Mm. So you can put those two together to get to really get the the, 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 the for those who love Jesus. You really mm. want to know something about Jesus? His name wasn't he Jesus. It was Yahshua. Yahshua. That's what's being taught to you in the mysteries of the Silent Brotherhood. Because the Morris Science Temple of America was created to bring these religious-minded people into their nationality and birthrights. Mm -hmm. Because at that time, our people were Christianized. So he couldn't present civics to them because they were dumb niggers. Yeah, and they ain't know nothing. They so because they yeah. were dumb Fresh and all they knew was religion, he brought them a form of religion with Jesus in it so they can't say they don't want to be part of it. Right. <laughs> but, then when you, but then when you get in, you realize and you understand that this is about nationality and birthrights. Here's your nationality. You're not Negro, black, colored, or whatever like that. You're Moors. We got Oscar the priest right here. He's gonna run for the for the congressman seat next week, and we're and we're winning because we already got this guy locked down. We got mm -hmm. Jesse Binger with us. We got Louis B. Anderson with us. We got mm -hmm. all these people. You think you think people are not gonna get down with this? Come yeah. on, yo. All right, and then what happened? People sold it out. Couldn't wait to sell so, it out. So, so we're not so 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 we're not mad. We're just gonna do what what was supposed to be what done was back then to now. Be done. Exactly. And that's that. And anybody exactly. who has an issue with it, anybody who has a problem with it, any other whatever like that, you could FOH because we can check your record to see that you're a sellout or you're mm -hmm. a trader or you're a whatever. And there's no real need for us to unify with you when we're already unified with all these other Moors. We know Moors in Germany. We know Moors in Switzerland and all that that know that they're Moors. So what do you mean there's no unity amongst the Moors? What do you, what, what, what it people is talking unity. About? Exactly. I, exactly. <laughs> what do you mean there's no exactly. unity? Me and you talking right now. I exactly. don't know you like that. We'll, I don't know each other from nothing, but just, just from our nationality alone, we can sit here and talk for an hour. Build just for from hour. nationality alone. Mm -hmm. So if that's how easy it is, why is it so hard with our people? And why is it so hard with Moors? We hard-headed. If, if, <laughs> <that's so easy. laughs> if, if it's that easy, right? Mm -hmm. I have a meeting going, going at... At six o'clock, I'm late right now. Yeah, that's yeah, cool. I, I got a tax class. I got a tax class that just started, yeah. and I'm, I'm kind of trying to get that going at the same time. But it's yeah, been yeah. A, it's been a great build, brother man. Yeah, um, just just send um, send your contact in the in mm -hmm. the DM, and okay, and, you know what I mean. We'll we'll definitely keep building. But okay. you know, don't don't look at that. You see all that online stuff and all that. I know that that's social media. Yeah, yeah so, we gotta so, be real. so they yeah. so they get they get that. You know mm -hmm. what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. Conversation, people get this. Mm -hmm. Indeed, I respect that. Online, respect whatever. That. Online, whatever you're gonna you're gonna get told stuff because I know that's virtual reality. I'm not mm. taking that serious, like like mm. like that's something. You're gonna get the dickest response that you can get <laughs> just because this social media. This is yeah, not it's real. It's tiring. It's tiring. This is that real? Mm. Send me in the DM. Like, what do you mean? How is that hard? Send mm -hmm. a DM message. You've been DMing when you wanted stuff, and then <laughs> now that there's some issue, you're going back and forth in some damn thing. All right, I'll go back and forth. Ain't no big deal to me. I don't care. Because I know that it ain't about that. It's about real life with me. Right. You know what I mean? So Islam to you, more. Give thanks Islam. for the build. Islam. Peace and, and love, brother, in touch. Peace and love. Peace and love, more. Islam, more. So you already know. Peace and love to all the mourns. Honor to all the mothers. Give thanks. Oh, yeah, there's the countdown, too. Perfect. Honors to the Prophet Noble Jwali and all active Moorish Americans, all active Grand Sheikhs, all active Grand whatever, all active temples and Moorish organizations and associations. Honors to you. Peace and love to all the Moors. Islam. <laughs>